This is our third pour for the day right now. Are you ready? Start. They were both excited, so we won't let go away. Three of your finalists are from Japan, one is from Australia. <laughs> At this point, it's less about the speed point, it's more about putting out the best design that you can. Second hit on though is a little bit ahead on the four. Okay, round of applause everyone. Talking hit on with a beautiful four there. Plenty of time, a minute and a half. So now we have Akagawa, Akagawa so go ahead and three four. I believe Takihara Ando did this pour earlier, and this one is executed ten times better. Just flawless execution on this pour this time. Typically, in the, as the rounds continue, we tend to see com the quality from the competitors go a little bit down. They're just not quite as sharp as they were in their first pour. Quite the opposite here. And as you just watch him for you can see all of those layers develop there. Round of applause, everyone. Beautiful pour there by Akagawa. It definitely makes a little bit nicer than the first pour. That was a solid decision. What's going to make this one tough for the judges is I definitely think Akagawa's probably got a little bit better color infusion because he's got just so many beautifully developed leaves in there. Kaki Hirondo has had that great pop, so he's probably going to get definition. Ando also got speed, and he did it. He's probably going to get improved difficulty and creativity, but we'll have to see what our judges think. It's rare that we see something, somebody do something creative in the final rounds, so it's fantastic to see the baristas here doing that. If you're just joining us, welcome. We're in the final four of the Coffee Fest Latte Hour World Championship Open being held for the first time here in Tokyo. You'll see both of these gentlemen re-pouring in just another minute. One of them will be pouring for first or second, the other one will be paying, will be pouring for third place, but they both will pour again. Okay, we got it. Okay, give us one more. Oh, 
Okay, David. Okay, so you can see on the screen two wonderful, wonderful boards. Uh, we've got, uh, what, a two seed versus a ten seed here in the final four. Uh, Ando's been showing us some stuff all weekend. Uh, the two hearts on the top, uh, he just keeps bringing it, changing it every single time. Uh, he got the speed, he got the degree of difficulty. I gave him color infusion, that gives him three points. I'm starting to call this guy Ando the Magician. Uh, amazing, 10 seat going on to the final match, Ando. Takahiro Ando! これもセミファイナルなのでかなり難しい勝負だと思うんですけど、えー、外観の美しさ、えー、バランスという点ではもう本当トースケがたいんですが、安、え、藤、ー、バリスタの、えー、鳥のモチーフがかなりもう左右対称上下のバランスも良かったので、えー、ポイントを入れていきます。で、えー、カラーインフュージョン色の使い方はやはりあの赤川バリスタはかなり得意されているのかなと感じまして、こちら点数をつけました。で明確さコントラストに関しても赤川、えー、バリスターの方が優勢と見て点を、えー、ポイントを入れてますで最後、えー、創造性と難易度なんですが、えー、この点はもう本当両方とも難しい技術だと思うんですが、えー、安藤バリスタの、えー、下のレイヤーのところの上げ方も非常に素晴らしいと感じたので、えー、ポイントをつけてますでスピードポイントは安藤バリスタ取ってますので、えー、ウィナー安藤バリスタそうですね、そのとおりです。Uh,